Hello children, very good morning to you. I am Monisha from Bharati Dasnar Matriculation School, Arakonam. Yes, so can you see the picture? Right? So what does the first picture refer children? Is that is doctor. Right? The doctor is treating to the sick person. Right? The doctor treats the sick person. Then, can you see the second picture? What does the picture it shows? That is postman. Right? The postman which carries your letter in his hand. Right? So, the first picture refers a doctor and the second picture shows a postman. Now, you see the third picture. So, what does the picture it refers to the person who uh, carries a gun in his hand. So, what is the picture? Yes, that is very good. Policeman, right? So, P-O-L-I-C-E-M-A-N, policeman. And can you see the third picture? Yes, very good. That is an teacher, right? A teacher teaches good manners as well as teachers to read as well as a write. Okay. So, who we are called? So, teacher teaching the good habits as well as they uh, teach to read and write. So, who we are called? Yes, they are all said to be our friends. Okay. So, like postman, policeman, doctors, teachers as well as the cleaners, they are said to be and how are help us. That means, so today's session we are going to learn about the people who help us. Okay, so the people who help us, third standard. Okay, so people who help us. Yes, children. So, in this, the first we are going to learn about the postman. So, I already said, right? So, what is the duty of a postman, children? The postman is need to. Deliver the letter as well as the parcels. D E L I V E R S delivers our letters and parcels. So in last class itself, we have learnt about the means of communication, right? So, in this means of communication, we learnt about the personal communication and mass communication. So, you know the personal communication. That means it's a one-to-one -one communication. So, the personal communication example, we say it as a post, right? So, letter. So, that means we write a letter to communicate with our friends as well as our relatives. And along with that, we will send a money orders and some of the parcels also. So, that means the person who delivers our letters and parcels is called a postman. Okay, the person who delivers our letters and parcels, we called it as a postman. Yes, so in every big village, okay, so in every big village, we have a postman and we also along with that we have a one post office at least one post office it will be there from one uh, from post office we will collect a stamp as well as a letters as well as an envelope etc in some of the big cities we have a more one or more post office okay so at least in a big village we have a post office in cities we have a many number of post office the main duty of the postman is to deliver the letters and parcels and along with that, the postman need to work. Yes, the main uh, work of the postman is need to work either in rain or else shine. Okay, so they need to work rain as well as a shine. Okay, so rainy or else sunny, they need to deliver the letters as well as the parcels to the people. The next we are going to see the another one important topic that is an doctor. So, why do we go, uh, need to go for a doctor? Is yes. if we got a fever or else if you are feeling 
ill or if you are feeling not well that time you go to the doctor right so what the doctor will do is give a treatment to you right that means the doctor who treats the sick people yes so now we are moving for a doctor topic okay so that is uh, if you are feeling not well what you will do if you went to the hospital right so what the doctor will do he will give us a treatment right the doctor who treats the sick people okay the person who treats the sick people we call it a doctor the person who treats a sick people so just see the picture the patient is suffered with some diseases so doctor is just analyzing right so he will analyze and he will show some of the report so based upon the blood test and based based upon the uh, disease uh, scan reports as well as everything so the doctor will give a treatment according to this the person who treats the sick people is called a doctor a doctor is also said to be our best friend okay so doctor is also said to be our best friend and <coughs> the doctor is said to be our best best friend and you see if we get injured what you will do okay so why for i assume that you are playing in a ground okay you got injured with that you are got injured in leg okay so what do you will do definitely you will go to the hospital from there the doctor will treat and they will remove and they will clean that and they will use the bandage right that means the applies the medicines and covers the wounds with the help of an bandage okay you will apply the medicines and you will clean that uh, uh, unwanted okay and after that they will apply a bandage and he advise to follow the good hygiene okay that means he advise you to follow the good hygiene as well as a proper diet yes a group of villages okay so in a group of villages at least we have a primary health care center okay so in a villages we have a primary health care centers so from this primary health care centers the person who are living nearby the villages they will go there and they will get the basic treatment okay so if the further uh, if they need a more treatment means they need to come forward to the city or else town okay so for example basic for in order to treat the basic requirements in order to treat the basic diseases the primary health care center will provide a tablet and also they will provide some of the medical facilities in cities you know we have a many hospitals okay in cities we have a many hospitals so in some places so in some places we do not have any dispensaries we do not have any primary health care centers we do not have any hospitals okay so in the cases they will supply that is they will supply the medical facilities in a van okay or else mini bus with the staff is said to be an mobile dispensaries okay so such we say it as an mobile dispensaries that means a places we do not have a medical facilities as well as an hospitals so in that place they will move along with the staff that is a staff which move along with the van or else mini bus and they will provide a medicines and other facilities that we say it as a mobile dispensaries so you know the meaning of mobile that means a moving sorry so mobile dispensaries the next we are moving for veterinary doctor so you know the veterinary doctor so who is said as a veterinary doctor yes that means the person who treats the sick animals okay just listen children the person who treats the sick animal the person who treats the sick animals the person who treats the sick animals we can say it as a veterinary doctor okay the person who treats the sick animals we say it as a veterinary doctor so uh, almost we learned about our helpers so in this session we just learned about the two helpers right that is an first we learned about the postman the next we learned about a doctor so the doctor who treats a sick person and they will perform surgery also so what is mean by surgery the process of removing the unwanted parts okay so unwanted parts you can say it is a surgery the process of removing or cutting okay so unwanted that we say it as a surgery and uh, next we learned about the postman so what is the use of a postman what is the duty of the postman is yes, the postman need to deliver our letters okay 
and he need to work either a rain or else uh, shine. So for further information, we have attached the study material, question bank and self-assessment. Do the self-assessment children and check it out how much you understood the concept. Thank you children.